Today, a reminder that no coast community stands alone amid disaster. Amber Spradley brings us a look at the efforts underway to meet the needs of families in Moss Point. The crew of Neptune's Trident Foundation is serving up burgers and hot dogs for first responders on day four. We're just providing the uh, first responders, the citizens that are out here working and trying to give them just a good hot meal. Uh, kind of give them a break from uh, all the chaos that happened from Monday night. Jackson County, along with the state emergency management teams, are running the command post for the city's response out of the fire station. With crews on the ground, MEMA Director Stephen McCraney says their first initial assessment of the area should be complete by Friday. To have these local groups that are from here to come out and cook uh, for the first responders, for those guys and gals that are working 12, 15 hours a day, uh, it means a lot to the responders, but then again, there's another group at the community center right now that's uh, for, for the locals and uh, the citizens and whatnot. That, that is, that's what's going to get us to the long term recovery. That's what will get us through it is a community coming together. Outside City Hall, Collective Church is partnering with Convoy of Hope and Mercy Chefs to distribute a tractor trailer load of supplies to residents. There's different needs that everyone has because even the nature of this tornado that came through. And so we're just trying to meet the needs right where they are, whatever they are. Senior Pastor Eric Camp says they've seen about 400 vehicles pass through for pickup in three hours. These people out here today, that's what keeps America going. You know, in the time of need. So I'm, I'm very thankful for, for anything I can get because I, I lost a lot of stuff, you know, the little bit that I did have and uh, kind of struggling. Residents Leticia Hollins and Sullivan Hill say crews are still working to restore power to their home. This is one of the worst storms I've seen in a long time. It's not a big, big, big one, but it's a crisis. About 50 to 100 people have shown up to volunteer throughout the day. In Moss Point, Amber Spradley, WLOX News Now.